Well, hello again. Today we're going to make a pasta bolognese. Um, I have rigatoni in here. I'm only going to use half a box. I have one pound of ground beef. I have a little bit of garlic in here, four pieces, one onion, and one carrot to give the sauce a little bit of sweetness. So let's chop the garlic. Okay, and garlic is chopped. Let's dice the onions. Okay, and the carrot, we're just gonna shred it. Let's see. Keep your finger away from this, this is very sharp. Okay, the carrots is shredded. I have some parsley here. I washed it. I'm just gonna chop it. And I have a little bit of basil also. And um, I have two cans. I have two cans of crushed tomato and a little bit of uh, tomato paste and i'm gonna put a little bit of tomato paste in. all right let's do it okay i have a hot pan here i'm gonna put some oil just cover the bottom of the pan a bit of olive oil and I add my onions Okay, a couple minutes, my onions is sweating. Gonna add carrots. And I'm gonna add my garlic.
You can deglaze it with some white wine or red wine if you like. I'm not going to add any. I just want to sweat the vegetables. Okay, you don't want to burn your garlic. Okay, I'm going to add my ground beef in. And break it. And the meat gonna release a little bit of water. And you wanna brown your beef. Okay, five minutes. My ground beef is brown. Let's grate the pan. Okay, we're gonna add the tomato sauce. This is just crushed tomato. Okay, we're going to add salt and pepper, about a teaspoon of salt, you can always add more after you taste it. Black pepper, I'm going to go a little bit heavy on black pepper. a little bit of oregano. I don't like too much, but just a little bit. A little bit of oregano. I'm going to put my basil in. Just going to tear it. Mix it. You can add a little bit more water. And I forgot the tomato paste. I'm just going to stir in a little bit of tomato paste. And if it is, if it's too thick, you can add a little bit more water. But for me, I think it's fine. Uh, parsley at the end. Okay, bring it to a boil and we're going to cover it and we'll cook it very, very slow for let's say 35 minutes and we'll check it again. See if it needs any more seasoning. Okay, it's been around 30 minutes now. Uh, my sauce is simmering, cooking very slow. Um, just going to add a little bit of parsley. And I have hot water here. Let's 
paste it. Okay, it's good. I'm gonna go another another ten minutes. Uh, my water is almost boiling. Okay, my water is boiling. I'm gonna add a little bit of salt. And I'm gonna add the pasta. And I'm gonna cook it for 10 minutes. Okay. And a little bit more. Let's do the whole thing, why not? Okay, 10 minutes. We'll be back in 10 minutes. Okay, it's been 10 minutes. And I'm gonna give my the pasta one more minute. It's still kind of a little bit usually cook it between 10 to 12 minutes okay okay it's 12 minutes and my pasta is done okay let's try it okay perfect okay my pasta my sauce is done my pasta is done so let's just mix some pasta with the sauce, then we'll top it with some extra sauce. Okay, let's plate it. Okay, let's plate it. Okay. Very good, Tony, with bolognese. Okay, bolognese. I'm going to add a little bit of extra sauce on the top. And to top it, to finish it, I'm going to add some picorino romano. You can add Parmesan if you have, but I don't have any. I'll just have Picorino or Romano. Okay, this is an easy and simple pasta to make. You can make it any day of the week. It's pasta bolognese with pasta bolognese. Simple and easy to make. 